Hey, what's up? Zach King here from FinalCutKing.com. I'm giving you this free motion template. This works in Motion 4. I'm going to show you a few quick tips on how to use this and customize it for yourself. This template is free and it's blue because we just hit 2,000 Facebook likes on the Final Cut King Facebook page. Make sure you go there and check it out. Search Final Cut King on Facebook or click the link in the description of this video. Once you download this on the website, I put a link in the description. What you can do is just go ahead and change your text and swap out your own text here. So if I go to the first text, just hit the T tool up here for text, select and start typing away. Also make sure in the zip file that you download you install this font, it's SF Collegiate. Install those on your computer to make sure this font is activated. Let's say we want to change the color scheme. Well, you're going to grab this rectangle here that is actually not check marked. The reason is because I'm using a replicator to give it this 3D look here that you see when it spins around. If you want to see a tutorial on how I do that, you can click right up here. I've got a link. Anyway, let's go ahead and make the color scheme orange. So select the rectangle, go up to the inspector, and go to the shape tab. And we've got a gradient here. This is the blue gradient that you see in here. Click the color well. We're going to let's go ahead and make this orange. Click the upper color well. So we've got a gradient. Now for the blue text, let's go ahead and grab text one in this case. Style. Go to the outline color here. You're going to see it's blue, but we just need to make that orange. And it changes just like that super easy again you can change the colors you can change the style of text and it's all in the free download available at finalcutking.com in the upcoming weeks you're going to see some awesome videos coming from me and the visual effects bro you can check out his channel here have a great week and i'll see you in the next video tutorial